What's going on everybody? It is your man Cleveland Terry and on Just a Tip episode 2 we're going to be talking about a daytime mode hack for the MacBook Pros with the touch bar or the fingerprint scanner in the top right hand corner. I know that Serato DJ Pro is coming out in their future update with a daytime mode that's finally going to be available. It took forever and it's finally going to be available with just a click and you're in daytime mode. But what if you decide you don't want to upgrade to the new Serato DJ Pro? I know a lot of people right now that are still on old versions of Serato DJ Pro and just never felt the need to update. So if you're in that camp, or if you are using Rekordbox or maybe Tractor and they don't have the daytime mode built in as of yet, this hack is actually going to help you. It's a really, really simple hack and if you've ever used your iPhone, then this function is gonna feel very similar. This only applies to the touch bar Max. Now the manual way to invert your display, which is basically an accessibility option, is to go into settings. So right now the manual approach would be to go into your system preferences and then go into accessibility and then go into display and then click on invert colors. And you're gonna get something like this. I gotta show you on here because it is not gonna show up through the recording. Now that's the manual approach. If I go into my touch bar here, and this is the fingerprint scanner, and I triple click this button. Accessibility options. The accessibility options are going to pop up. And if this is your first time doing it, it may ask you if you want to have the accessibility available right when you triple click. If it doesn't offer that, then we're gonna do it manually. So we're gonna go into preferences, and then we are gonna click on this invert display color option right here. Close it out. Now, all we have to do is triple click. Accessibility options. And invert display color is right here. Key to navigate. So all I have to do to toggle on option. is click it once and I'm done. And then when I need to get out of it, I triple click again accessibility options and click it off and done easy as that just that easy and now you have an easy way to get to it now once again guys thank you for checking out the videos i hope to keep these quick tips going for the least through the summer and maybe more so if you like what you're seeing hit that like button if you're really liking what you're seeing hit that subscribe button i try to post once or twice a week and uh guys make sure you follow me on instagram and twitter same thing for both of them Guys, always a pleasure. If I don't talk to you later, we'll talk soon. Peace.